Shinigami's eyes is half of that person's remaining lifespan. That's all it is. Okay, so let's see what Lightning had decision. I'm, I'm so curious. Has anyone seen Ryuk started. around lately? Maybe he was serious about losing his death note. It was probably picked up by some human before he could get to it. So, the price for receiving the eyes of a Shinigami is no more than half of my remaining lifespan. That's it, right? Yes. Well then, do we have a deal or not? This deal is out of the question. Huh? I knew this. I'm not gonna think he's gonna do this. He's not the slightest bit daunted by the fact that I'm a Shinigami. He doesn't suck up to me, and he seems to have no problem giving me a hard time. Yep. He's a hard guy plus also. Well, a smart one. Mm -hmm. you sure there's nothing else you want to tell me ahead of time? Shinigami? No. Nothing else. Nah, probably. I think I just figured out how to find the name of the guy who was following me today. Hey. How are you gonna do that? I'm gonna use the rules of the death note to my advantage. I already know that if I write down a cause of death, I've got six minutes and forty seconds to record the conditions and exact time of death. First, I need to know exactly how far I can go in terms of specifying the details of death. This should be interesting. What? <laughs> Bizarre behavior before they died. Could you be more specific? What do you mean? So they didn't just die from heart attacks. No, what I'm saying is they all died of heart attacks, but it wasn't quite that simple. Before one of them died, he drew a pentagram on the wall of his cell using his own blood. Another left a letter, but it doesn't seem to be a will or anything meaningful. And as for the third victim, he escaped from his cell and ran all the way to the staff bathrooms before he died. What is it, Watari? Three more heart attack victims, but the circumstances of their deaths are different from what we've seen. Before. Sounds like he was afraid that Kira would find him. It's believable that our victim might have been genuinely afraid and wrote this, but we know Kira can control the time of death. What if he can also determine the actions in the moments leading up to death? In which case... Chief. Hmm? We can't release details of these men's deaths to the media. As far as they're concerned, these are just heart attacks. Hmm. I have reason to believe that Kira was performing some kind of test using these criminals. And if that's the case, we'd only be giving him the results if this information is leaked to the public. Right. I understand. Look at this, Ryuk. I think we're in luck. The results of yesterday's little test have already been downloaded onto my dad's computer. And these results are just as I expected. The death note will work for what I have in mind. What do you mean by that? Possible. Yesterday on the news, they said this drug addict tried to rob a bank but was unsuccessful. He attacked a few people and then ran away empty-handed. I'll use him. It's kind of last... He's still following me. Perfect. This whole thing would just be a waste of time if he wasn't tailing me. Light. A date? Yeah. <laughs> it's a date no matter how you look at it. And I'm sure even my stalker will see it that way. But this isn't just a date, is it? You said that you'd figured out a way to find your stalker's name. So tell me, what do you plan on doing? Huh? Come on. Didn't you see what I wrote in the death note? I explained it in great detail. No. Doing that would take all the fun out of it. In that case, just be patient and watch. Oh my god. During the week, he goes to school and cram school at night. Dates on his day off. A normal kid, just a hard-working senior in high school. Chief Yagami's son. Light Yagami. No cause for suspicion. At any rate, I'll be done with my surveillance today. And that'll be it. It's him. He's here. And here we go. 
Seven passengers excluding him, no one's in the way, everything should go smoothly. Stay in your seats unless you want to die! A bus jacking? You gotta be kidding me. Everybody shut up! If anybody moves, I'm putting a bullet in their head! Oh my god, I'm suddenly right, feeling driver. cold. You listen to me. I know you've got the number for Spaceland's office on you. Call him! Okay. This, this is Sasaki, calling from bus 174. Beauty, don't be scared. As soon as he turns around, I'm going to grab the gun out of his hand. Don't be stupid. That's risky. If it comes to that, I'll take care of it. It's okay. We don't have to pass notes back and forth. As long as we keep it down, he won't be able to hear our voices over the sound of the engine. Do you have any proof that you're not his accomplice? Why should we trust you? Accomplice? Yes, I've read about this before. The first hijacker comes in like he's working alone. Meanwhile, a second one pretends to be a hostage and stays in the very back just in case something goes wrong. What's the matter? You... you really think he is one? I... I have no choice. I'm sure Light Yagami isn't Kira. If he was, he could just kill this guy with a heart attack. Here's my proof. Take a look. So smart. FBI. Oh my god. See, El needed so good. Outsiders. We got the FBI to investigate anyone connected to the Japanese police. His name is Ray Penber. Hmm. I'll trust you. And I guess for the time being, I won't bother. Ugh. Don't move, you little punk! What the hell is that? <sighs> smart ass! You guys were planning something back here, weren't you? Damn it. If he sees that note from before, he'll find out the light was planning to jump him and take his gun away. <laughs> Plans for a date, huh? Stupid kid. Gotcha. <gasps> who, who the hell are you? You in the very back. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Don't mess with me! How long have you been hiding back there? What's what? This? You're talking to me? So you mean you can actually see me right now? <sighs> Stay there, you! You! Keep away from me, you freak! This isn't good. He's hallucinating. Everyone, get down! <laughs> oh, I get it. That little note that Light accidentally dropped. Oh my was god! From the oh my god, this is so good. Itself. Since he tricked this guy into touching the paper, he's the only other one on the bus who can see me. That's so smart. Get away! <laughs> Sorry, pal. I'm a Shinigami, so I'm afraid your bullets aren't gonna kill me. Anyone who touches the death note can see me. I have to stay till the death note is finished or I see you die, whichever comes first. And the Shinigami can't die from being shot. I've said all these things at one time or another. Well, he is the top ranked student in the country. Yeah, of course. He even used this hijacking as a way to get the guy following him to willingly give up his name. It's not the bus! Let me off! This was a smart move. This was actually a very, very genius move. 11.45 on the dot. Everything went just as I planned. Kiichiro Osoreda. Accidental death. Boards the 11.31 Spaceland Bound. He's a horrific phantom and empties his gun trying to kill it. Terrified, he flees the bus. Immediately afterwards, at 11.45, he dies when struck by a car. The death note never fails. And he also just is incredible.
You will be next. Oh, you are Great such Emperor. a big mess right now. <laughs> you shouldn't be giving the FBI card at the first place. Huh? Oh, I just turned it over my god. <laughs> इसके बाद आज के लिए बस इतने तो अब तुम लोगों ने वीडियो तक देखी है तो लाइक करके जाना और चैनल कर सब्सक्राइब करके तुम लोगों को नेक्स्ट वीडियो का नोटिफिकेशन मिल जाए मुझे लगा तो तुम लोग नेक्स्ट वीडियो में तब तक के लिए